Alright guys, I'm back with another toy video. This is the Shroomy by Mumbot. Really, really cool figure. Really excited to have one of these. I'm actually going to be customizing this one. So this is actually a blank Shroomy that's not painted. Mumbot asked me to be a part of an art show and custom show that she has coming up later this year and I was super honored to have that opportunity to you know work with such a phenomenal artist and friend and really really stoked to, to customize this one um, I have a lot of ideas on it it's a really cool simple figure it's got a really nice hand sculpted feel it's really traditional you can see a lot of like the tool marks on the surface and the hand done feel to it is just amazing I absolutely love it there is technically articulation on here on the top it technically does rotate but that's actually just to help with the design for Safubi of how they could pull the toy out. I'm not sure if that was something that was intentionally planned um, by Mumba but it's definitely a cool feature of the toy and allows you to have a pretty dynamic look. When they pull the vinyl out there can be some slight warp and distortion but that's really common in, in Safubi figures that have really tight seams like this with flat edges. But honestly, I think it adds a lot of character to the piece. I think you get like a really unique look. And if you turn it, then the, you, you, the seam starts to actually disappear. So you can kind of rotate it. There's definitely a, a lineup point in the back here. There's two small little notches where they're supposed to line up. So you can kind of see that in there. It's kind of cool. Uh, might be a little hard to see, but there is a little notch in there that is meant to line these up so you can kind of see the, the planned orientation of the toy. Now I had a bunch of ideas for this one. I'm going to actually be cutting this one up quite a bit for my idea and doing some surgery on here and doing some sculpted pieces and making some molds. It's going to be slightly more complicated than most of my customs that I do and uh, I'm, I'm kind of excited. I'm excited to do this one. I have a few weeks left to really get this one done. I'm supposed to go to Designer Con. I'm still kind of waiting back to see if I'm going to get a table with somebody um, I talked about getting a table with, but if that works out, I'll definitely be there. And uh, yeah, I'll probably be dropping off that custom and it probably won't be revealed until the show, but I'm going to film the process so you guys can see it. But yeah, super cool figure. Really, really cute. It's a fun one. Uh, the face detail is really neat. It's probably a little hard to see with the harsh light here, but just a super rad figure. Everything that Jade does is awesome. Uh, go follow Mumbot. Go pick up your own Shroomy and Mossy. Well, Mossies are out, I think, right now. Go pick one of those up for sure. Support independent artists. All right, guys, that's going to do it for this little toy review video. Uh, thank you guys for watching. Again, this is a new series for me, and I'm just going to be reviewing the personal things that I collect in the designer toy world and the things that I customize. So yeah, just uh, like, comment, and subscribe, and Wolf Bits out.